All right, guys, Mark Boy 316 here with another video, and this is my what I watch. This is a two week what I watch. Uh, the first one, for some reason, I kept track down the DVD, but I watched Bad Max, the very first one in 19, uh, I think it was 79, 1980. It was uh, with the Mel great, great movie. I uh, highly recommend it. The other two movies I watched during the week was Napoleon Dynamite and Without a Battle. And I also saw both nights of Halloween Havoc. Uh, Eli Dragunov and Carmelo Hayes was a great match. And uh, the TL Tables, Ladders, and Scares with, I think it was the, the oh, D'Angelo family and the Creed Brothers was awesome. Fantastic stuff. There was uh, Monday Night Raw, which Seth and JD McDonough had a great match. Two great tag matches DIY and Imperium was a great match. And the match of the night was the Creed Brothers against the Alpha Academy from Raw. Great freaking tag match. Awesome stuff. And uh, a pretty good episode of Raw. Uh, ended up watching uh, last night with my friends Todd and Nick. I ended up watching uh, New Japan Strong. <laughs> Power Struggle, I should say. Uh, NWGP, uh, New Japan Pro Wrestling, uh, Power Struggle. Uh, what a great uh, event uh, that was. Especially uh, Will Ospreay and uh, Umino, Umino, if I can say his name. Umino, I should say. The Red Shoes, the referee's uh, son. Great uh, main event for the US uh, and UK IWGP, tag, uh, IWGP uh, titles. Great match there. And uh, pretty good damn event. Match from top to bottom. Great stuff. Uh, the six man tag titles was good with Ishii. Uh, Okada and uh, Tanahashi defending the six-man tag against uh, TMDK, which was TM61 back in the day, and uh, Zack Sabre Jr., so it was a great six-man tag title match, good stuff. I just wish TMDK would have won, well, that was a good six-man tag. Uh, just some great stuff going there in, the, in New Japan, it was awesome. And uh, ended up watching uh, AEW with some uh, some good matches on there too for, for AEW. And uh, yeah, we had new six man ROH tag titles that it was the Embassy uh, defeated uh, the uh, Elite Young Bucks and Hangman Adam Page. So, new six man ROH tag champs. So, what are some uh, good stuff? The Adam Copeland, the Christian segment was awesome from Dynamite. He actually hit the spear on Christian. Said he would be Darby Allen's things uh, tag partner for the pay per view, so that'll be good. Uh, just some great stuff, great stuff all around in wrestling. And uh, also, uh, actually, Austin Theory and and uh, Kevin Owens on SmackDown had a good one on one match. And uh, Elliot Knight, Roman Reigns promo on SmackDown was awesome. Like, just some great stuff all around. So, it's basically what I watched. Like I said, I watched uh, Napoleon Dynamite without a paddle, uh, Mad Max with Mel Gibson, and uh, yeah, a lot of uh, wrestling pay per views, and uh, some uh, wrestling on TV. I did not see Crown Jewel, but I saw the results from what I seen. It looked alright for a show. Uh, Logan Paul won the US title, and uh, that was cool, and then they had LA Knight lose in a 20 minute match to Roman Reigns, which was the typical bloodline match, and uh, Kairi Sane made her return, so that's cool, but yeah, other than that, this is Mark Boy 316 with his What I Watch, uh, thank you guys for joining me, I'll catch you guys in the next one.